Jake DeBrusk, one for five in the shootout this season. He'll go for Boston in round one against Charlie Lindgren. DeBrusk straight ahead, fires, he scores. Left shot coming in, and he just moved and swerved slightly into the middle and just about snapping it over the catching mitt as he was moving a little bit laterally. Here he's on the left side, watch him come to the middle and then just fire it, and it beats the catching glove of Charlie Lindgren. Oshie, 41% in his career, one for three this season. In the shootout in the bottom of the first, looking for the tying tally against Swain. Oshie fires, no five hole there. Swimming got his big pads together right at the right time. Oh, definitely looking for the five hole, and he doesn't give it up. Here's Swayman, a great look from behind there. You can see the opening, but the stick down, the butterfly does the damage there against TJ. Charlie Coyle enters the proceedings in the top of round two and swings wide. Coyle, fire stick save, Lindgren. Trying to get the goalie moving slightly with his right skate. But Charlie doesn't bite on it because he too was going five hole on this play. Wide right shot and just trying to snap it underneath that left padded stick. And it's not given up by Charlie. Strom had a winning goal in a shootout recently against Carolina. He'll carry straight in on Swayman. Deeks to his back and he scores! That was slick, that's for sure, and lit. What a deep cop was. How the heck are you supposed to stop that move? Now move all the way to one side and then come back around on the backhand. That is a thing of beauty by Dylan. Charlie Lindgren meet David Pasternak in the top of round three. Pasternak curls, fires, it rolls to the line! He scored! It bore its way it. through Lindgren across the goal line. Not even sure he waited to see that puck roll through his body there and turned around and saw it go. You have the continuation of the play here. It's not over till the puck is dead. Here it is. Look at Charlie. He's not even sure where it is as the weight of that puck gets through the seven hole, off his body, off his arm, and into the net. Milano has to convert. Sonny Milano, for him to backhand, he roofs it! Those are some silky mitts there. <laughs> top corner on the backhand, are you kidding me? The little curl, and up top, and look at where that hits, where the bottle, water bottle hangs out. Marshan in the top of the fourth. Marshan with speed, lets it go. Lindgren makes the pad save. Washington can win it in the bottom of the fourth. And here comes the big man. And the fans are all standing here, all 19,000 of them for the great eight. Alex Ovechkin 0 for 6 this season in the shootout. Now's the time, big fella. Ovechkin walks in, motorcycle kick. Swayman kicked it away. Everybody is standing in the building. This is fantastic. And the anticipation of Ovi coming out was something. And here he comes in and Swayman just kicks it away with the right pad and blocker and keeps it out. He was compact, not a whole lot of daylight there. Shattenkirk, the first defender to try. Shattenkirk roofs one over the glove. Advantage Boston. That was some shot there. During regulation, he had just one shot. And here he comes in and just drills it right over the catching mitt of Charlie Lindgren. McMichael has to have it. Connor McMichael swooping in forehand. Carry glove save. Swayman, Boston prevails. What a hockey game. If I could have this every night, other than the Caps winning, I would take it. This was a game of the big boys. The way the Caps are playing now is playoff hockey. Unfortunately for John Carlson and the boys, the shootout and the Boston Bruins Swayman gets them here in Washington.